Good morning once again. Whoops. Good morning once again. Ladies and gentlemen, girls and boys, coin collectors and silver stackers, bringing you one more video for today. And this video will be the pretty uglies. And it is specifically because um, Rose Dragon says she loves the pretty uglies. So I'm just going to give you a glimpse of the pretty uglies that I have. Alright, let's start off with the one that ain't in a flip. It was in my pretty ugly state quarter book. And it will be... Let's see. Da, 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 da. Let's, let's get this right. It will be this one. And then we'll give it a flip over. Ohio. I just found that yesterday in Pennsylvania. Alright. Let's move on to this dime. I think there is uh, not exactly sure what's with this one. I have not had it looked at. I will sometime. But both sides are like that. You, you're not going to be able to see with this camera. But it is missing the U and an U and Unum. Alrighty. Let's move on here. This is a 1996 that I just found yesterday in Pennsylvania in a roll. Both sides nice and toned. Alright, what do we got next? This I found a while back. It is a Mississippi state quarter. I don't know how justice how much justice this camera is actually doing for these coins, but you can pretty much get the the picture on it, as you say. Alright. Here comes the Hawaii. I showed this in my first video, but this is the Nebraska. It is gold tone. This one is my favorite. I love this one here. Alrighty, moving on. Let's go into some some uh, silver here. This is my. 1945p war nickel nice toning to it the big p on the back after that we have another 1945p war nickel beautiful now right moving on This is a 1956 five centavos. It's 72% silver. Look at how that nice it looks. Found this dinging through my a bag of foreign coins. My mom said, "Do something with these." <laughs> okay. I also found this in the same bag, a 1935 George 5, 10 cent Canadian dime, 80% silver. Absolutely gorgeous. I know the light on this is glaring, but it brings out a lot of the good stuff. Alrighty, I showed this on my one of my last videos this is the ugliest quarter you'll ever see and yes there is a date you can see it is 1984 
and both sides are like that and for the last and certainly not the least and I thought when I found this I thought I found something miraculous and then realized it was a fake This is a, a 1990, I think, can't really see all the date, because somebody tried to fake a cut error, and they did a horrible, horrible job. But if you, if I can get in closer, you can see where they pressed the reverse of another coin on the back of that. Let's see how, let's see what we focus here. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, that was the worst job at baking something. But I did find that in a roll of half dollars. The back side is nice and pretty. And they destroyed the front side, but I thought it was cool. I figured I'd keep it. So, that is the end of my pretty uglies. Once again, good luck on your hunts. Thank you for watching and stay positive.